Hello, okay, we finally got the 2011 and 2012 control board replacement tested out. So here's the the controller with the case on, and here's what it looks like with the case off. See, that's the board. Uh, you Basically, you just take the old board out, you take the little connectors off with just a little, like a little blowtorch from wherever, and they fall right off. You just heat up the other side and you give it a shake and they just fall off. And then you just solder them on to the new board. What, what we're going to be doing is like a little swapping program with people. Like if they want to buy a board, they could um, either send us the old board or just send us the old connectors. And then we could send them a new board with the connectors already attached. That will be an option for you if you want to do it. And it just uses the standard old... Uh, connector that there is in it you have the option if you want to to use the the connector to the outside world that's waterproof if you have the Nissan Leaf wiring harness so actually the assembly I mean installation is pretty easy you just pop the top off here un you just unscrew these pop the top off unplug the board in the five different well six different plugs just stick a new one on and then you're ready to go and you have all the software available and everything so here's a quick test of it let's see put the top on there we go so i'll just give it 12 volt power and it, it can handle it can deal with the pre-charge sequence too like it deals with the pre-charge contactors and also the contactors that are outside of the controller so then you can just give it a little throttle and then there it's spinning so this is set up for reverse right now so it's spinning there it goes that way now let's say we want it to go the other direction Here's a little, you can have, here's forward and reverse. There's a wire, right, it's supposed to be a little switch. You can, if you turn the switch off, you can change directions. See, now it'll spin the other way. And alternatively, that's just if you wanted to go uh, put it in reverse for uh, backing up a car. But if you wanted to make your uh, make it a permanent thing where you only you want the let's say you want standard to be reverse I mean standard to be clockwise or standard to be counterclockwise you can also change settings in real term on the computer so that you can make officially the forward direction to be clockwise or counterclockwise and then in addition then. The forward and reverse would just be the opposite of whatever the uh, clockwise or counterclockwise is. I don't know if that's confusing. <laughs>